Hello, this is Lord Dog. Yes, it is, and I'm happy and excited because I am here with the competition results. Yes, they've been drawn, they've been done, and we know the winners. Well, and you will too soon. So, let's get to it. And uh, first of all, let's say this is quite a, a big video anyway because this is my 600th video. So, I'm actually drawing. The competition result on my 600th video which is quite good and also I have now hit uh, have now gone past 100,000 video views I know they're not all 100,000 different people but still you know, I've had over 100,000 video views on my videos now so I think that's another milestone so yeah it's uh, it's all good but let's get to it anyway let's get to the winners now I didn't choose these winners right and I'll be honest why I could not choose Simple as. I could not do it. No, because... Right, and this is going to sound corny, but it really is true. I love you guys. I think you're amazing. I cannot separate you because I don't want to disappoint anyone. So, you know, I had, I had like, double figures in, in entries. And I wanted everybody to win. Even them that weren't as good, obviously, as good as some others. I wanted everybody to get a prize. But, of course, you can't. That's not what competition's about. Competition's about having winners... And them that don't, and them that don't, then get to try, you know, later on in another competition. So, I couldn't do it. So, I gave it to someone else, and they could, and they did, and they picked three winners. So, uh, I'm going to tell you them, uh, I'm going to tell you them now. So, first, uh, well, these are all first place. But the first one that actually they read which was the last entry. And that was the one they said was the best. I'm just saying, I'm not commenting who's as best but they said this one was the best so the first winner of a of two well it'll be a pack of two don't starve at least if they're still doing that off of with two it is a uh, razzles 129 so razzles 129 congratulations and we'll tell you what razzles said and then you'll know why so uh, i would be a type of weather snow which I know you can put the winter hat on and make snow, but this is like a proper um, weather pattern that would come in game. Uh, I, either I would be a new biome, an icy one, or over time the seasons would change and it would start to snow. Being that snow is cold, the player would have to make better clothes, possibly out of beefalo wool, to survive or risk dying of the cold. Therefore, a new round meter would appear under the hunger one, your character's body heat. The clothes would not completely negate the loss of body heat. It would just slow it down enough for exploration and time to get back to a fire to heat to heat and heal up. Walking round would also slow down the loss of body heat due to the walking being exercise and movement. If there were if they were out in the cold for too long, they would slowly lose heat and they would and if they didn't get to a fire or craft some warm clothes they will fall into a deep sleep and the game would be over i would also come with new mobs roaming snowmen that attack in bands and take two to three hits to kill something like spiders and they drop snowballs which can be used as ranged weapons uh, there also be a very rare yeti that pops up from time to time that would have a lot of health and require top tier items and great skill to kill to kill it but when killed it would drop a yeti head 20 meat and yeti hair the head could be mounted on a wooden plaque or used and, and used as decoration or worn on the head like a mask and would make all hostile mobs run in terror the hair would be used to make better and warmer clothes for longer survival time without uh, visiting a fire the night would also be longer as it was during the winter and the time of day would shrink so that the time of night is the same as the time of day. Also, food would be scarce. The beefalo would be hibernating. The rabbits would seldom come out of their holes and uh, the berries, grass and farm and that take longer, a lot longer to grow. The pigs would also stay in their houses until the winter is gone so the help that you can get from them, say with hounds or things like that, wouldn't be there anymore. Uh, what, an, 
what I'm essentially is a further into the game test of player's skill. So it would be kind of like a later later in when somebody like me who's got over two, three hundred days and you know you bring it in and it starts in you know you either get this new biome or it starts snowing then and you know makes things really hard for that kind of time. You can have it kind of triggered I suppose from the uh, wait though. I'll talk about all that after. Let me just finish your read it rest. Uh, play skill and their stores of materials. That is the thing that I would be if I could in Don't Starve. So this one, hell of a lot of thought. It came, you know, everything was explained. The weather pattern, the new biome, the night time, the monsters, how much they kill, what they drop. This was a really good entry. And uh, like I say, there's a lot that that could go on and you could have it triggered after so many days. So like if somebody reaches 200 days, then it starts to trigger. So every so often it snows and covers everything in snow. And yeah, you know, it just makes it hard for that person. And yeah, you know, we'll go from there. So yeah, anyway, I'm not going to discuss it any further than that. The first winner is Razzles129. Congratulations, Razzles. I will be getting in touch with you. And of course, you'll need to have Steam so I can send you the game through Steam. And uh, I will, you will hear from me soon. Right, the next winner is. I'm going to do them in the order they were picked. Uh, the next winner is. Let me just find it. MC Monkey Meanie or Muck Monkey Meanie. Uh, hello, this is his. Hello, I would be a new biome. Uh, you can only access through a special golden bunny hole. You have to dig up the bunny hole with a shovel you get from giving the pig king an amulet. Once you dig up the hole, you will enter a weird place with a, a boss kind of guy called the bunny king. He can only be killed by the shovel you get from the pig king. Ten hits kills you. Ten hits kills, I'm guessing kills that, and he can kill you in four. Uh, he drops a baby hell bunny. <laughs> this special bunny, you need to protect it for three days. One hit, and it's dead. But if you can protect it for three days, it will turn into a little cute bunny that for one day, every seven days, will follow you around and just tell and you can tell it what to kill and it will kill it so it goes from being this little one it will kill it bunny if you can protect it for three days then one day it'll just then you get a day where you can just tell it to what to attack and it just go nuts on whatever you tell it to attack uh, once it turns into night the bunny will turn into an item and you will have to wait another seven days to use it. Back to the bunny biome. Well, there will not just be bunnies in this biome, but a castle holding the bunny king with armoured bunny guards. <laughs> Four hits, uh, and they and you kill them, and uh, it takes six hits, them six hits to kill you. And you will get to loot chests with stuff you find in graveyards. Every castle has two special rooms. The golden chest room where you get a chest that can hold 18 items. And the other room will be the bunny king's room. This might not have too many items but it gives a new edge to the game. Like when they added the nether to minecraft. Hope you like my idea. And uh, there you go. And I do, McMonkey Meanie, I absolutely love your idea. So did the George. You know, it was uh, picked because of uh, you know, how you went on with like the, it may be the, mainly the baby bunny. See the bunny rat, the bunny hole thing. Uh, no, don't get me wrong, it was a good idea. But the, I got about five people say that because, of course, it alludes to it in game. So, you know, it wasn't that that swung it because it could have gone any way. There were five people I could have chose from. But uh, that did the uh, bunny hole thing, so I couldn't separate you guys from that. But the one that did it was that the judge loved the idea of the little bunny, the uh, hell bunny, that could change into a normal, that could change into this normal cute bunny, but could rip apart just about everything for one day. So you could really tear into things, and I think that's a great, great thing. So, uh, yep, you are our second winner. And I will be in touch with you very soon and to gain you your prize of two Minecrafts. Oh, uh, not Minecrafts, sorry, two Don't Starves. Hopefully they will, uh, if they're still doing them in twos, I hope so. And I will send them to you soon. I'll be in touch very soon. And the last winner chosen by our 
by the judge. I'm not telling you the judges. If the judge wants you to know, they'll tell you in comment. They'll say to comment. If they don't, then they don't. I'm not, you know, I'm not bothered really either way. Okay, next we have. Uh, here we are. Stormer Titan. Welcome. At, uh, congratulations, Stormer Titan. You did well. And I will read this out. My idea was to have a new item, biome, re recipe, and boss. The new item is called the lantern, and you can put it on a new slot next to the hat. You can put the lantern on. You can put sorry. You can put the lantern on it, so you have a portable light source that is like the miner's helmet, but lasts longer and gives bigger light radius. The lantern helps a lot in my new biome because it's a dense forest. It's really dark at all times. In the biome, there will be lots of spiders that take two to three hits to kill, and a boss spider queen, which takes five to six hits, and it drops nine spider legs, which are also edible, which can be used in recipes. The spider queen also drops ten gold and five meat. The recipe with the legs is two spider legs, one honey, and one apple, which gives you honey-coated spider legs with apple sauce, which gives you 99 health points and 95 hit points so uh, there you go and the reason that, that this one was picked right was um, not so much the lantern idea because of course you have got the miner's helmet even though it does give a little bit more light it kind of negates the, lan the the helmet unless of course you make it a lot more expensive than the helmet to make but if you don't then uh, it's gonna kind of negate the miner's helmet so it wasn't so much that but what it was is the new biome's a really good idea. A dark, dank, thick forest with lots of spiders. Not just your couple of nests here and there, but lots of spider nests. And if you go in, you're going to be bumping into them all the time because it's dark and spiders come out in dark. They're always going to be out. There's not going to be a time that they like go, have to go in and sleep. They could be wandering around at all times. And of course, th there's times where they will lock onto you. They don't do it all the time, but they will at times. And when they do, you're in danger. And then on top of that, you've got a spider queen that you know that can give towards recipes and things like that. So the spider queen would be good for farming because the recipe, the honey-coated uh, spider legs with apple sauce, gives really good stuff. 99 health points and 95 hit points. So yeah, it was uh, it was that that won it over. So there you go. It. Uh, that is the third winner, Storm Titan. You have uh, also won. If, uh, you, you, I'll be. I think I've got you on Steam. I have. I've got you on Steam anyway. So, I will uh, contact you soon, and I will send you your your prize. So, congratulations. And uh, that's it, guys. That is it. That is the competition over. There's been some good other entries. I've got to admit. I mean, there were others that were really close. I don't know whether I should mention names because I don't want it to feel like, oh, damn. But, yeah, there were some that were really close. Oh, oh, oh I will. Uh, Enderstenders was a really close one and uh, because, you know, they did uh, like a bunny hole one that was quite in-depth and that. So, uh, yeah, that, that, one, that one was nearly one I picked. Well, not me, the, the judge picked. And uh, the remix... Sto oh, it's a stone stream he did a good one which uh, I, I liked so uh, and uh, but you know like I say if it was left to me there'd have been a lot of winners but the you know, other judge separated them and just picked others but you know what I liked about remix stream was he did like something to do with night more than just oh you can't go in it because there's something nasty there he actually brought something else into it which you know was also a good idea so you know to, to to others that didn't win i'm sorry guys you know it's just how it is congratulate the winners next time it could be you and uh there will be another competition soon i promise you on that so uh, don't worry about it so i'm gonna go and uh, i will be in touch with the winners soon congratulations guys and uh, uh thanks for taking part to everyone that did so you all take really good care of yourselves and Goodbye for now, my friends.